Welcome to another exciting tutorial. Today we'll be learning how to make your sound better in Adobe Audition. So this is our sample image which I have recorded. You can listen to this. All right, and this is our improved okay. version. First thing first, if you are in the library mode, like this, and just click the develop on. This way, we'll be having lots of editing options on. So, let's get started. So, just open your file which you have recorded in the Adobe Audition. So, first thing first just expand it or zoom it zoom in so that we get all the waveforms see easily so first of all we'll remove the noise from the audio file just click it and drag so that it selects a certain part of your audio file which has noise I think uh, uh, this is the email this is the file uh, which doesn't have anything while you say this is something which is the room sound or the where area sound where you have recorded the file so it basically has some noise so in order to remove that noise we'll just select this part of the audio file then we'll go we can go to effects noise reduction capture noise print okay then we can press ctrl a by selecting to select entire file like this and then again go to effect noise reduction noise reduction process and just press apply and it will take some time and it will remove all the noise present in our audio file so when processing is done you can see the slightest of difference between what it was originally and what it is right now so next thing go to effects amplitude and compression and select nor, uh, uh, sorry uh, go to filter and equalizer select parametric equalizer select the loudness maximizer from here and press apply what it basically does it adds some thickness to your voice and go to again go to effect amplitude and compression compression and uh, select normalize process and you can put in 95.8 at i uh, i mean from 91 to 98 you can put any number but for uh, the this present case 95.8 works best for me so I have just set it and then press apply then again go to effect amplitude and compression select dynamic processing and this is the uh, preset which I have created for myself actually you can note down the numbers which is here and here so it basically does this kind of a shape right you can experiment with this these numbers and you can come up with your own but this is what I have this is what I have uh, got myself got for myself and press apply again go to effects amplitude and compression and go to normalize process again the same number press apply effects again amplitude and compression compression and press the s and this is what i have created for myself on uh, this preset hh but if you want to do something right. at your own you have to do you have to just separate these graphs like these graphs are together these graphs are together so just take these graphs and just separate them 
put them into this box by dragging this handle click and drag and press apply it will take some time it also thickens the voice then again effects filter and EQ parametric equalizer again loudness maximizer and press apply and we are done so this is our after uh, image in this part uh, we'll be converting this image to and if you want to see where we have started we have started okay let me go back from there this was the uh, original original file original voice and this is the processed version let me tell you what is non-destructive editing is all about non-destructive editing is so there is a there is a sea of difference lots of difference so thanks for watching if you like please don't forget to subscribe my channel thank you so much